Well, George, I mean, that's 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 hard to bear, isn't it? So many positives, but still come away with nothing. Yeah, no, I'm just disappointed, to be honest, because I think, um, you know, they've only conceded one try, I think, in four games, and we scored two today, and I think we could have scored a couple more, to be honest. So, disappointed with our uh, lack of accuracy on a couple of moments. But, yeah, you can't fault the fight and the hard work. And, um, uh, you know, we, we're building well, and you know, the game's going the way we want it to go. But... Um, disappointing to come to the double champs and be so close. The positivity in the, in that side is is coming through in it just in waves, isn't it? I mean, the first half you could see that you'd actually shot Exeter out of any patch of the game. Yeah, the, the boys are, we're in a good spot as a squad. You know, we're working really hard. We know how far we got to go, but we know we're building the foundations of what we want. And and the guys are becoming a really tight group who work really hard for each other. So. Um, you know, we, as I say, we know we're not perfect, we're not the finished article, but the lads are fighting hard and, and they want to win. And so we're actually just disappointed today, to be honest, because I thought we put ourselves in a position to win a couple of times. A good variety in the way you're playing and attacking, but uh, your defence was such a weapon as well today. Yeah, our defence, you know, we've changed a few system things and it's taken a bit of time to come to fruition, but Dom's done a great job and, and the boys are really buying into it. And, and like with any system change, it takes time and it's, it's coming to fruition now and it's aggressive and it's um, hitting people hard. And um, yeah, I think, you know, X have found a way through it a couple of times, but it was, um, it was pleasing to watch. You talked last week about the idea of the mindset. You know that in a game the opposition are going to get their phases. You certainly know that's going to happen down here. But at the end, Gloucester come back into it again to, uh, to score more points and put pressure on the home team once again. Yeah, and that's, that's just good fighting spirit. Like you say, you certainly don't come here and get a little bit of a lead or get close and then Exeter don't pull away a little bit. That's, that's the nature of high-level games. So um, I think we're getting better at dealing with things like that. And I think that's... Um, not an accepted part of it but it's, it's an acknowledged part of it and you've just got to fight through those tough times and then hopefully get yourself back in and um, I think like you say if we weren't fighting our way back in that would be a concern but the boys are staying on task and, and working extremely hard. As you say fighting your way back in does that make it difficult for a coach because you've got to be pleased about so many aspects of the game but there are still things that you really you really want to nail hard to, to be able to pull off victories that I'm sure you know was a possibility you here today. Yeah, absolutely. And, and, you know, we came here believing in ourselves. We, we weren't here just to make up the numbers by any means. So that's why we are disappointed. But again, you know, the, even without watching it back now, I, I could name a couple of things where, you know, we could have put ourselves in and we didn't. And, and that's what hurt us. So I think if you were losing games and there was no answers, that would be a problem. But, you know, they're, they're quite easy answers for us. It's just working hard on those areas and, and keeping trying to get ourselves moving up. And the physicality was up today, which has got to be because Sale next week will be physical once again. Yeah, Sale will be really physical, yeah. They've got a massive pack. You know, they've got some uh, some huge blokes in there who run extremely hard and tackle extremely hard. And, and obviously, that's, they finished right at the top of the table last year, rightfully so. So, um, there's no easy week. Um, Exeter and Sale back to back and then Newcastle away, they're, they're really, it's a really hard few weeks for us. But um, we'll embrace it, work hard and, and turn up each week.